Hi everyone, this is Tan here. Today I'm going to be doing a little quiz of based around the seven Koopling, some of my favorite Mario characters. And I'm going to try these videos with no face cam to see what y'all think. I'll make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. So let's begin. So, what is your favorite color? Personally, it's purple. The closest to that is probably blue. What is your opinion on school? I burned it down. I find it to be very important as without school, not much would have been possible for many reasons, such as. I. Yeah, I think that's pretty fair. You know, was it fun all the time? No, but did it teach me a lot of valuable things? Yes. Fair food. Big Macs? No. <laughs> that's funny. In every quiz I've ever done, steak's good. Italian? Yeah, I mean, I'm Italian. Probably have to go with this one. Um, vegetables? Um, I like, yeah, vegetables underrated. I adore eating some caviar or gourmet dishes. Well, they're nice, but not too often. Popcorn and basically... All that stuff. So, you know what? I want to go with vegetables, right? Why not? Do something different. You see Mario with the princess. What do you, what do you, what do you do? Um, so, oh, if you are coupling, I'm like, what? This is a weird question. Punch Mario and grab Peach. Distract Mario when my sibling goes and grabs Peach. Taunt Mario until he chases me and then lead him to a trap. Reminds me a lot of the opening cutscene with Bowser Jr. and Mario and New Super Mario Bros. DS. Man, um, you won't do that one. You see Luigi alone. What do you do? These questions, man. Alrighty, ask him if something's wrong. Um, take his coins, put on a Mario costume, and make him think you're a Mario and that the product plan doesn't bite. What the? Whoever made this has a good sense of humor. Um, prank time. What a loser. Paralyze him. Oh my gosh, he's a good type subject for my new invention. Um,. This one's just kind of as funny, but I'll probably ask him if something's wrong. What do you think about Bowser? He's the king. I think highly of him. Um, you mean my dad, boss? Oh, yeah, he's uh, uh, he buys me stuff, so I love him. He's the king. I think this is the last question for this one. What do you think of Bowser Jr.? He's great. Um, we're good friends. He wants me to use his clown car. This is probably the answer for Ludwig, because that's always... Oh, wait, wait, what did I hit? shoot back no wrong thing okay we'll just go through this real quick um vegetables um extract okay we're back with bowser jr um there we go how do you like this quiz i think it was great one of the better coupling quizzes i mean this is my first one um i hit it it was terrible it was good some flaws but overall it was good yeah, it was funny. So we'll go with the top one. And I am Ludwig. Really? Okay. You are Ludwig. You like composing music. No, you are smart. Sometimes you're the oldest coupling and you have your trademark tufts of hair. I guess. You, although being the smartest and oldest, you still like video games and act childish at times. I sort of. Worlds have taken over and include the Skyland. I mean, I do like nature in the sky multiple times in the Twin Bridges. Whatever, I'm not impressed. Time for a leader to step into the plate. Really didn't think I was getting Ludwig here. Um, That's kind of funny, though. That is kind of funny. Yeah, Ludwig is kind of always the oldest and the smartest. Koopling, always liked his design. Thought the hair was really cool with the shell. He always had a kind of a deep voice with him. Alrighty, here we go. Let's go to a Koopling quiz, like trying to answer some trivia questions. Um, okay, the youngest of the Kooplings, I think that is Larry. Lemmy's actually one of the oldest ones. This Koopa kid was named after his grandfather. He wakes up in the desert land in Mario Bros. 3 and guards the Donut Plains Castle in Super Mario World. That is Morton Koopa Jr., hence the Jr. I really wish they kind of did more of this lore thing with the grandfather. I think that's really cool. Yes, Koopling is the only, okay. Wendy, oh... Koopa. This wacky Koopling's inventor resembles his brother Larry, only with different hair colors. Dominic's giant land in Super Mario Bros. 3. I believe that's Iggy. Yeah, I mean, he's an inventor. He does look kind of like Larry, I guess. The next Koopling is so heavy, he causes earthquakes when he jumps. He, drugs him, he dwells on, among the clouds of Skyland in Super Mario Bros. 3. I think this is Roy. I don't know, I forgot he was in Skyland in that game. It can't be Morton. 
I think it's Roy. The next Koopling has aspirations of joining the circus. This held back due to his IQ. Um, yeah, I think that's Lemmy. I think it's like the second oldest, or maybe the oldest. The last Koopling is the smartest of the seven, and the smartest of the seven. Uh, that's going to be Ludwig. All right, pretty cool. In which of these games did the Kooplings not appear in? Well, they're in Mario World and Mario Bros. 3. Yoshi's Island. Is that like Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island or a different game? Oh, man. I'm going to say that one. I don't know if they're in Yoshi's Safari. In which name did the Kooplings make their first appearance in Japan? The thing that's throwing off is in Japan because in... The U.S. It's, it's Super Mario Bros. I want to go with that. Three Wars. So is it Super Mario World? Are they not in Super Mario Bros. Three? And what was the first game featuring the Kooplings? When did Mario Bros. Three come out? Is that 1990? We'll go with that. Okay. So we got that one correct. We got all of them correct so far. Um, Yoshi's Island. They were world bosses in all three games. Really, they're in Yoshi Safari. I want to look that up real quick. Perfect. Wow. So it was released in in February 1990. Oh, in Super Mario Bros. 3, the Kooplings had no names. Okay. And then, I want to do this other Which Koopling Are You quiz just to see uh, how I would get. You see Mario running towards you. What do you do? Jump into, in, into, into one of your machines and destroy him. Punch him in the teeth. Um, shoot probably bouncy balls. What is your favorite color? Man, purple, finally. We're getting there. Uh, I'll do the Mario one later. What would you like? What would you like to build a fortress? I have personally always liked the jungle. So go with that. What could you never live without? Damn, microphone. Money's important as I've gotten older. I... Because when you're younger, every villain in kids' movies wants money. And yeah, they're doing it greedy, but money's important to survive. So that's, it, it helps you get other things in life. What you do in your spare time? Kill stuff, jeez. Um, anyways, no, I'm joking. <laughs> um, video games, that's a weird answer. You know, I want to, you know, I want to put video games. Suppose Bowser gets defeated, what will you do? Um, uh, man, these are very morbid questions. Um, what? Um, yeah, I'll probably fight Mario. Yeah, why not? No, this is, these Kubling quizzes, man. These people are <laughs> interesting. Who like, Some of these answers are like, okay, what is the worst thing that's happened to you? Um, well... I don't think I've ever been beaten up in the sense of beaten up. My creation is exploding. Not really. No one liking me. There's kind of some isolation moments in school for me. I'll do that. What class is your favorite? Um, I always liked debate. Socratic seminars were my thing, even though people didn't like them. I did. Which, I mean, would you want to have as your pet? Is there, there's no chain shop? Really? Come on. Um, Mecha Koopas are cool. Or stalking P Piranha? No. Cool again? Or Petey Piranha. Yeah, Petey Piranha. Cool boss. And my favorite is Iggy. Can we get Ludwig again? I got Iggy. You are super smart, but you love to tease people and laugh like a maniac. I do like to laugh, as you probably have noticed that here. So that was fun, y'all. That was a pretty fun one here. Nice and relaxed. Let me know again when you think of the no-face camera. Until then, take care and have a good one.